Hi guys, another video about search engine optimization. Uh, in this video, I am going to uh, talk about a tool, something. Uh, last in last video, I was talking about page view, Google page view. Sorry, Google not Google page view. It's page speed. Yeah, Google page speed insights. And some people ask me how this BU.tk took that great number. It's not a great number, but it's a better number. So 89. How it took. And every time when I develop a website, it's taking um, a good value in page speed. Then uh, people ask me, what are your secrets? Uh, do you use secret tools? No, no, I'm not using any secret tool. Today I'm going to tell you what kind of tools I'm using. But especially in this video, I'm talking about a cloud-based tool. What is a cloud-based tool? Okay, I hope you are a developer. So I, I have nothing to hide. Now I'm going to, to tell you, and now I'm talking about a tool called Cloudflare. Here, you have to type Cloudflare, CDN. Yeah, this is the website, cloudflare.com. This is the tool I'm using right now to get a good page speed number on Google. And this tool, it's uh, there are a lot of videos in YouTube and other video promoting web, uh, website. You can find a lot of tutorials real about Cloudflare. So I'm not talking about Cloudflare uh, features and other stuff, but I'm, I'm going to explain uh, how I use this system to take uh, good search engine optimization results. Uh, simply, I have to explain you a few stuff about Cloudflare. I found these images from Google. So now I'm using these images to explain about Cloudflare. Here, without Cloudflare and with Cloudflare, how it, how it works. Without Cloudflare, just say you have a website. Anyone can visit your website directly. Let's say your servers are located in Canada. Then anyone from Sri Lanka, India, um, uh, let's say Portugal, UK, China, Japan, anywhere from the world, they are directly visiting your website, directly visiting your server. Actually, the client requests directly to server. But this Cloudflare is different. Uh, what are disadvantages with that direct request? Here, visitor can directly visit your server and also crawlers and bots, especially Google search, uh, you know, Google, like search engines like Google, Yahoo, Baidu, that kind of search engines. They are using crawlers to collect data from web pages. So they are also visiting your website directly. These kind of crawlers, Normally, they are making huge server loads uh, because they are collecting, they are reading every page uh, in some kind of fr frequency, like let's say uh, one page for, for five seconds, like that. They will read 100 pages, 1000 pages. When they read your website, it's taking some resources from server, so your server can overload. If you are using a small server, let's say there's an attacker, he also directly access your server. This Cloudflare is a tool. It is making a cache, me like cache means it's like an image of your main website. This this Cloudflare, what what it is doing is, um, what, what it's, it's when you. A visitor visit your website or crawler visit your website or attacker visit your website then they are going through this Cloudflare servers here in the, their website they are showing uh, their 
location data center locations so you can research more about this cloud cloudflare protection there are videos on their website uh, what they're doing is they have data centers they, 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 they have their own servers all over the world then when someone visit your website with cloudflare then they are not sending the visitor directly to your server they are passing them through the their server and at uh, the meantime they are checking uh, more details about this visitor especially some ips are blacklisted in the world they are using those ips to attack websites so cloudflare knows main uh, ma major ip addresses uh, of attackers then cloudflare will simply block the attacker so your website is safe and also you can uh, control these visitors you can block some countries uh, accessing your website you can blacklist some ip addresses so there are a lot of features with this, this Cloudflare. So for search engine optimization, this tool is affecting a lot. Why? Because uh, here you see they have a lot of data centers all over the world. So your website is stored in their servers. Um, it will be a little bit complicated for you. If you are a beginner what I'm trying to tell you you normally you are, if you are using a small server if you have a uh, VPS virtual private server or a shared server or dedicated one anyone but you have one server but Cloudflare have uh, Cloudflare has there are a lot of servers all over the world they are storing an image of your website in their servers let's say this is Sri Lanka. Your server is located in uh, Seattle or somewhere here. So, if a Sri Lankan visitor directly visit your website, so you see, they have to request here and receive again. But um, here they are showing Cloudflare has a Sri Lankan server here. Um, if uh, your website if you are using a cloudflare then a Sri, Sri Lankan visitors has their own data center so cloud for cloudflare uh, team uh, from cloudflare so your webs an image of your website is located in this area so they, the Sri Lankan visitors they they uh, don't need to request f far too far far away just request to their own data center and receive the image as soon as possible like uh, it will work like in a flash so this is how cloudflare works I'm, I'm not good teacher or I'm not I cannot explain everything clearly but I just try to explain you everything um, um, my recommendation you have to watch some videos on YouTube and also on Cloudflare website uh, there are a lot of tutorials you can follow them and understand how it works and here the, the here is another video uh, sorry a, um, an image here it's showing how it works original server or in somewhere so Cloudflare it's making an image of your website and let the visitor access your website easily and in in a flash and also it's protecting your website from attackers for search engine optimization uh, search engines uh, are using crawlers to read your web pages so normally if your main server can be uh, if you have a big traffic uh, then your server can be slow it can be slow down and um, then it's getting overloaded though so it's completely uh, without this kind of cloud network it's hard to um, 
handle the traffic also those crawlers if you are using cloudflare uh, then google or yahoo any search engine they will get an image from cloudflare servers and they will do their optimization algorithm using those images uh, they don't want to re-access you, uh, your main server directly it's safe and it's also fast then it will affect your search engine optimization results in a major way and also it's increase in your page speed and uh, in uh, on, on the in that google page speed results that's it so this is a small video it's about cloudflare how to use cloudflare uh, to improve your search engine optimization results i hope you will use this tool the, the, there are no secrets with uh, my creations this tool is free if you are using more features they will charge some for your features but normally the free service is enough uh, for a small website so i hope you will use this cloudflare and get more uh, improved results from google search thank you very much thanks for watching